when you think of a commando, you think of battle-hardened, tough, special operative, special forces kind of guy behind enemy lines, OSS, paratroopers, men who are willing to give their lives to lay in mud and shoot at people and survive when no one else can. But what happens when the commando has given its all, proved its might, and given up the ghost, can no longer lock? Well, it can rise from the ashes, my friends. This key can open this lock. Yes, that's right. Despite having left its carapace of this laminated lock that I so much devoured with a Dremel. The core of the lock, the locking mechanism itself, is now contained within this otherwise not very secure master lock, padlock, solid steel. Now, I'm not gonna argue as to which one of these two locks is more secure or stronger from terms of construction. I could rip this apart, but I don't feel like it. But I can tell you they both have the same locking mechanism now. And neither of them has this one, which is kind of a piece of crap. So if your commando ends up like my commando, have it go commando and do something useful. Now, to be completely serious, I'm not suggesting that you should buy a commando lock and rip it apart and rape it like I did and take its cylinder and make a few small size modifications to the tailpiece with a file which takes 30 seconds and then put it in a different lock body made by commando's competitor. Um, not necessarily saying you should do that. What I'm saying, however, is if you did do that, it would work. And then you would have this master cylinder, which you could, I don't know, make a cutout of or something, or send it to Bill for him to shoot guns at. I don't know. However, I bet you the price of this cylinder, if you wanted to rekey, if you had a master lock or some, or an American lock or any other lock that that this cylinder would fit that you wanted to rekey and you wanted to buy a new cylinder versus just repin it probably a better value to buy one of these <laughs> and put their cylinder in this lock um, this looks like a six pin lock it's only got it's only pinned with five out of the from the factory so I don't know commando maybe you guys uh, maybe you guys should just start selling lock cores as well um, and uh, I think it'd be worth the investment and save on dermal bits. But anyhow, um, just a little lock hack. Um, they don't fit as well in Americans, but they fit great in that lock. So there you go. So commando, cylinder, going commando. And yes, it is just this flaky with the master lock cylinder in it. Just that's how it is. So anyhow. Have fun.